Welcome back. The Lobos close out their two-game road swing this afternoon in Fort Worth, Texas against TCU. And I must say, it definitely wasn't the outcome anybody who's a Lobo fan was anticipating. New Mexico fell earlier this week at Colorado State. The Horned Frogs, like the Rams, are undefeated on their home court. For the Lobos, it spells trouble as New Mexico played from behind for the majority of the game in the first half. This game was a seesaw affair. Lobos picked TCU's pocket and it's Jamal Fenton finding A.J. Harneman for the jam. It's 21-20 Lobos. UNM takes a three-point lead now. The shot is way off the mark and Drew Gordon is left all alone for the easy basket. It's tied at 38 at halftime. As for the second half, it belongs to the Purple. Knotted up at 48. Connell Crossland throws it down off the miss. TCU goes on a 10-0 run. With three minutes to play now, TCU puts this one on ice. Up eight, it's Craig Williams hitting the three-pointer. The big fella, you know it's going to be a bad night when that guy's hitting threes. The Lobos lose by 19 points. 83-64 is the final. They fall to 22-6, and 8-4 and in the Mountain West. Check out that body language. That is not good. They are now tied with UNLV for first place in the conference. So here's a look at the stat sheet. A.J. Hardeman is the leader in scoring with 15 points. Kendall Williams did not start, but he chipped in with 10 points off the bench. Drew Gordon scores just 7 points, but brought down 12 rebounds. New Mexico has 16 turnovers in this one, but 33 overall this week. They had 17 in their loss to CSU. The Lobos may be showing signs of fatigue. The defense allowed a season-high 83 points scored on them. TCU had six different players with 10 points or more. That's not going to get it done.